Pop squat. Coming at you. We've got an old one. An old one to do. Deltron 3030 is the band, and the song is 3030. This is from 2000. This is not a band I've ever heard of, and I'm very curious about it. This was on the album Deltron 3030. Wow, 24 tracks from the year 2000. This is listed as rap, abstract rap, West Coast rap, Bay Area rap, hip hop, and alternative. I am very, very curious. Uh, the opening song from Deltron 3030 classic self-titled album in this song, Del paints a vivid picture of the post-apocalyptic world in the year 3030. Haha, <laughs> we just listened to 2093 and now we're going to do 3030. And sets the stage for the rest of the album. The song contains samples from the song Introit, Introit from William Scheller and a drum sample from Cerrone's Rocket in the Pocket. Hopefully I'm pronouncing those names correctly. Uh, is this just the beginning of that? Yeah, so this is... Is this really the first track on the album? It's track number two. So State of the Nation was first. I don't know if that was not music. I don't know. But this is the epic opening song. I don't know who these guys are. I've never heard of them, even. Deltron 3030 is a hip-hop supergroup comprised of... Oh, yeah, I remember Del the Funky Hopo Sapien. Producers Kid Koala and Dan the Animator, uh, Automator. This was produced by Dan the Automator, this particular track. Their self-titled 2000 debut was an innovative sci-fi hip hopper. Why, how, how did I not know about this? This sounds like absolutely something that I would have loved. Detailing the exploits of former mech, of a soldier, of a former mech soldier turned rebel Deltron Zero. Throughout the tape, Deltron Zero and his sidekick Automator compete to become the Intergalactic Rhyme Federation champions. In 2013, they released their long-awaited sophomore album, Event 2. Wow, this sounds super cool. Deltron 3030. Let's check this out. Um, thanks again to everybody. Thanks for becoming a patron. If you haven't become a patron, information is down in the description of the video. I'd love it if you would. And uh, let's check this out. 7 minutes and 30 seconds. 3030 from Deltron 3030. Let's go. Thanks to, uh, I'm sorry, thanks to Avery for sending in money for this. Avery, I'm hoping I like it. It sounds awesome. Gotta make it feel spacey. I'm calling Apollo 9. Calling Apollo 9. What is your definition for? Calling NASA. Calling NASA. This is Apollo 9. Condition green. We've landed on Mars. Nice beat. Sorry, that just is fantastic. Like, very much, I, I don't know if I'm using the right terms, but very much chill hop sounding to me. It definitely sounds like electronic music, techno stuff that I would have listened to. Like, the slower stuff, not the crazy what turned into EDM. Uh, whoa, that sounds good. Oh, man, I'm going to have to listen to this whole thing. <laughs> I just want to say right at the beginning here we get this whole long intro they set up you're in space something something's weird right because they're f fucking with the the way the sound sounds the way this tr uh, transmission sounds slowing down speeding up going it gets just strange so something's not right you get that feeling right off the bat and then this music starts and the music is super super cool super chill very relaxing and then they add in these weird and again kind of makes you go what in the, what's going on like this isn't right so you, like right off the bat 
it, at least to me, I get that they're introducing some sort of things are not going to be healthy in this song, in this setting of this world that this soundscape is coming from. It's very cool. <laughs> Things right again. Yo, it's 3030. I want y'all to meet Deltron Zero Hero. Not no small feet. It's all heat. Uh, yeah, so that's why I know Del the Funky Homo Sapien. He's. He worked with. Uh, he worked with gorillas, right? And, uh, Del the Funky Homo Sapien. Clint Eastwood, yes, yep. I absolutely remember his voice. It's fantastic. In this day and age, I'll rage a grave. Anything it takes to save the day. Neuromancer, perfect blend of technology and magic. Use my rapping so you all can see the hazards. Plus entertainment, where many are brainless. We cultivated a lost art of study, and I brought a buddy. Automate a heart of slay, a fascinating combination. Cyber warlords are activating abominations. Armination with hatred, we ain't with that. We high tech archaeologists searching for knickknacks. Composing musical stem the impacts the soul crack the mold of what you think you rap before i used to be a mag soldier but i didn't respect orders i had to step forward tell them this ain't for us living in a post-apocalyptic world morbid and horrid the secrets of the past they hoard it now we just bored it on our futuristic spacecraft no mistakes black it's our music we must take back <laughs> it's funny they've had a couple of mentions of things that are like very science fiction centric um neuromancer they mention here the book by oh why can't i remember his name uh and neuromancer who was the book william gibson right uh and then they mention even something like stim packs they mention um and what was the thing that they just mentioned? Feeling like a ghost in the shell, like that's classic anime. Uh, probably pretty new at the time. Gotta be pretty new. Ghost in the Shell is 20 plus years old, right? So there's, um, yeah, 1995 was the first one. I thought it was pretty old. Uh, let's keep going. Uh, and I'm sure there's going to be more of those sorts of things in here. And I, I, that's awesome. They'll play a host to a cell for the pure verbal. They said my sentence was equivalent to murder. Just another hurdle. I bounced through a portal. I knew they had the mind state of mere mortals. My ears morphed to receptors that catch up. Every word about gravity control and the families they hold for handsome ransoms. On the run with a handgun. Blast bioforms. I am warned that a planet wide manhunt with cannons will make me abandon my foolish plan of a rising. Fuck dying. And I hijack a mech, control it with my magical chance. So battle advanced through centuries of hip hop legacy. Mega speed, hyper warp the automators, cribbing like the torch. They can't fight the force. Victory is ours once we strike the swords. Enterprise and wise men looked at the horizon. Thinking more capitalism is the wisdom and in prison. All citizens in power with rhythm. We keep the funk alive by talking with idiots.
eternal evil concerned with thievery medieval prehistoric rhetoric well we ahead of that lay it down with sound waves that pound pavement original minstrels my central process and unit is it too with my heart for this art not artificial cause that makes it hard to miss you copycats finish last in the human race staying glued to safes too prude to take a Buddha break we got espers that let us bless with fresh shit undetected by yes men questing for five fleeting nanoseconds of fame protecting the brain from conspiracies against my cosmos while I float the Neo Tokyo with OPO or discuss combustible rust clusters with plus evade cyber police and a computer it's funny he mentions Neo Tokyo and uh, I'm sure that's been used in lots of different animes and things like that but I, I think Neo Tokyo was the name in the Ray comic book from Valiant back in the day I, I want to say that was right Oh, it was just New Japan. Okay. Interesting. But yeah, Neo Tokyo, I'm sure, has been used in lots of different things. Uh, and there were other things that were mentioned. But he mentioned mechs. I used to actually work on the Mech Warrior game, um, the little plastic figures of it. And um, the Force, he mentions, although it's not capitalized. Uh, it's the Cyber Police is coming up here. That's just, it's so cool. Espers, he mentions. That's so cool. It's just so much fun. It's so geeky and dorky, and I love it. You the crib confuse the kids, but I can make a kick and rise as sacred. Telepathic mind that takes its greatness from the matrix. Esperon professor rushes a cold depression with correction measures. While half the world's a desert, cannibals eat human brains for dessert. Buried in a deep dirt, mobility inert. I insert these clothes for the cataclysm. Ever since I had the vision, use my magnetism in this modern metropolis that tries to lock us up under preposterous laws. It's not for us. sets it up super super well that he sets up uh what the world is like what the conflict is what they've got to deal with who they are how they escaped what they used to do or what they used to do how they escaped the forces that are after that like this this is a ton of storytelling in it and it still sounds like a pretty decent rap song like it's good and it's absolutely part of a whole, greater whole right like uh, really super cool like incredibly well written and put together very cool uh i don't know how i ever missed this i mean i'm i don't I, I really don't know i was living in madison at the time that's probably part of it there wasn't really like a hip-hop station until right about 2000 um I was listening to electronic music, quite a lot of it at the time. Not quite so much hip hop, which is probably how I missed this. I didn't know where Del the Homo Sapien had originally come from. I hadn't heard any of his stuff until Clint Eastwood from The Gorillas, and then I was like, whoa, this guy's great. But I never followed up on that. Like, oh, who's this guy? I don't know. He makes music that I don't know about. Wow, cool track. I, I, I gotta go check this out. This is probably if i still got drunk or stoned um this would probably be an incredibly cool album to listen to while altered 
Uh, really, Avery, yeah, thank you for sending this in. Wow. Super cool. Uh, I got something else to check out. This is great. Love it. Pop squat. Check it out. Please like, subscribe, share, cash app, PayPal, Patreon over here. Thank you very much. I will be back with some more music soon. I don't know when. Soon. Bye-bye.